What's up, folks? Welcome back to Baby Little Burst. I'm your host, Michael Nightwing, and today we're unboxing Divine Belly Out from Beyblade Burst Ultimate. Got this bad boy from the folks over at 4 Gaming. Thank you. And we're going to go ahead and get into this box. First and foremost, we can take a look at the back and see it comes with Belly Out 2. So they just remade the Belly Out 2 chip with a nice red color. Then it comes with Divine, which is going to be fun to look at. Three, Nexus, and then Adventure. I looked this up, right, so I can see like what this meant, and essentially it's like the same stats. So the first one is like attack, then the bottom is like endurance or whatever, and I'll pull up on the screen so you all can see it, but these are the stats for this one. Very skewed heavily to the left. It also shows there's supposed to be more gears that come in. So it's already been spoken of an A gear, uh, and a so an Achilles gear and a D gear from Dragon. Don't know what this last one's supposed to be, but it's gonna have more gears and just make this thing even bigger than its predecessor, which is insane to me. But let's go ahead and crack it open. Eh, eh. It's not working. Come on, open up, open up, open up. There we go. And I got the rare. God, it is no rare color. At least not that I know of. I don't have a rare color. It's the regular degular joint. Regular degular joint. All right, so first and foremost, I'm disappointed if you already know about two things. Nexus, again, and three, again. Lame, super lame in my opinion. Uh, they need to come up with some new stuff, but whatevs, whatevs. We don't need the stickers. So let's open this. Actually, let's take a look at the weight all together first, and then we'll do each part individually. So in total, it's 69 grams. And let's compare that to, yep. So down in my belly aisle is, yeah, it's just pretty much the same, pretty much the same. All right, so let's take a look at Adventure. Comes in at eight grams. And then Nexus, of course, comes in at 30. Belly aisle two, eight. And then this actually feels super light. Like it has metal right here, but that don't even matter, bro. Like this thing light, hold up, hold up. This thing comes in at what, nine grams? Let's see how much guilty, guilty weighs. 16, yeah, like this thing, like this metal ain't metalin. Oh, nah, oh, nah. Yeah, okay, so this is definitely not gonna be the heavy hitting attack type we all hoped and anticipated uh, by any means. Like this thing is, yeah, okay, right. Uh, adventure, now this goes in. So, is this even rubber? Okay, so where this is rubber, right? This piece is rubber, this is not, this is plastic. Yeah, this is 100% plastic, so what? Uh, okay, I'm not, I'm definitely not understanding now like what's going on with this thing. But the easiest way to understand a blade is to put it into the stadium and see how it does. But as of right now, I am not, uh, I'm not feeling it. It's beautiful though. I'm gonna be using this chip for sure. But I'm, I'm not, ooh, ooh, waste of money maybe? I'm not sure. We're gonna see in the stadium though. Let's, let's get to that. Okay, so we're gonna do a generational battle real quick with the new Divine Belly Out and then all of the previous versions. So we're just gonna go with regular Dynamite, Dynamite, full figure, and then full figure uh, Dangerous. See how it does. I can definitely hear that plastic on Adventure moving around. And it's definitely giving some, it's giving some speed, but it's actually gonna be worth it is the question. Mmm, nah, homie. Great speed around the stadium, but it doesn't even matter because no one's up there, bro. No one's even there. There we go, now we got some good contact, but it's definitely not going in Divine's favor. Yeah, I don't think this is it. Ugh. 
I will say the driver to chip connection is tight. All right, let's try Perfect Belly, y'all. I feel like it's gonna be the same type of outcome, really. Uh, decent hit, but uh, I don't know, man. I don't know. Oh, that's cool. Oh, show me your speed. Show me your speed. And blah. All right, let's try one more with this one. All right, all right, can you get the hit? Unable to get the good hit in. Yeesh. All right, the last test against its like youngest or newest self. Vice versa. Okay, well, you know what? With uh, yeah, we're gonna. Oh, okay. Okay, folks, and that'll be it. That'll be uh, the finale of this video here. So again, this is Divine Belly Hour from Beyblade Burst BU, and this is what we got. This is it. Uh, I think the red core is pretty solid so far for me. I have seen some uh, reviews from both Illinik and also the Beyblade Geeks stating there's got a little stuck damage and whatnot. Also saw a morning a uh, video this morning from Zanke about uh, the belly owl chip core being just you know stronger. I like it. I haven't had any issues so far. I find that since it is harder to unclip it actually makes it better for burst resistance. But yeah we'll see. So do me a solid favor subscribe to the channel like this video if you can please go home and tell your uncle that you love him. Appreciate you so much for watching. You have a beautiful and amazing day, and I'll catch you later. See you.